She went away on Christmas. Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 3. I hope you're having a wonderful December. Um, so this year for my birthday, I just didn't want to party with any friends, so we didn't have one. And I really didn't ask for anything, so I really just got money, which trust me, is a great thing. So we're gonna start off with what my sister got me because it's kind of out in the open. So she got me this cute little basket. She got me the book Reminders of Him by Colleen Hoover. Um, this book's not really the type of book I'd usually read. Like I love Colleen, but not really like about like the mother fight type of thing. That's not really like what I enjoy. So we're gonna see, but I've gotten into the first chapter and it's pretty interesting. So I might surprise myself. And then she got me this crazy Erin's thinking putty because she has one of these. She's had it since she was in like fifth grade and I go in her room and bother her all the time and use it. Um, the next thing she got me is the Sol de Janeiro perfume. I like 68 and 40, I think they're both good. I also got a Pura Vida bracelet. And then she got me this keychain. It did not have the juicy part on it. It looked like this when she gave it to me. So it's just this pink little, it looks like me, I agree. And then this is the car key my parents gave me. And then this juicy is our family joke. So if you understand what this means, you're, you're gonna know what it is. Okay, we're gonna move on from that. And then she also got me this candle, peppermint sugar cookie. It's really good. I literally have had all of this stuff in the basket and I keep wanting to use it and it's so hard for me, but I did break into the perfume. I couldn't help myself. And then the last thing she got me is this cute sweatshirt, which I've been wanting to wear so bad, but I've been waiting. So it's from the brand Charming One. It's boutique. Very cute. I can't wait to try it on. She also got me this pillow tie that's pink, but I, again, couldn't help myself. So I'm not gonna say how much money I got because I feel like that's just weird, but I'm gonna tell you so this is from my great grandma. She gave me money and previously she had given me a Chick-fil-A gift card. So thank you. This is another birthday card. So this is from my great grandma and this is from my grandma, her daughter. They're identical. They must have matching taste. And she also got me money in a Starbucks gift card, which I can't wait to use. And I haven't been using it because I've been saving it for this exact video. So, and I did already get a Starbucks gift card for my birthday in this card where I had the Chick-fil-A placeholder card. I used it all in one day because I bought my family drinks, so it went quick. Um, this is another birthday card. This is from my grandma. She was very sweet this year and generous. She gave me money and then she also gave me a $100 Lululemon gift card, which I appreciated very much. The next thing is this card that says Elise on it. This is technically for Thanksgiving, but I think the card's cute. It had an Ulta gift card in it, but basically for for October, it's Ainsley's birthday, so I get a Halloween card, and Ainsley gets a Halloween card for November. Yeah, it keeps it fair. This is from my grandma, and she gave me money, but she also gave me a trip to Hot Springs, which are basically mineral bath resort spa. It's something in North Carolina, which I'm going to tomorrow, so that's very exciting. And that is it for like cards. The other thing that goes along with this card that I just showed you with the gift card is this bag. Grandma also got me these Victoria Secret pajamas and I left them in the bag just for you guys so I can finally take them out. I've been dying to wear them. Okay. Loki hard to untie, I'm not even gonna lie. Whew, there we go. Here we are. I might have to wear them tonight, I guess we'll see. Okay, lastly. Um, my parents got me this necklace I'm wearing right now from Kendra Scott. I'll see if I can. I'm literally covering up like the gym. Yeah, it's the black druzy something. I don't know. I found it like five months ago and I sent it to my mom. Basically, here's a fun fact about me. If the metals are not gold or sterling silver, I get this weird metally smell. I basically, my skin reacts to the metal, makes this awful smell and like, I can't stand it. It's genetic. It's not like, it doesn't happen to everybody. It happens to one of my grandmas. So I'm not really sure why, but it does happen. And the smell is just so awful to me. It smells like a million pennies. It's so bad. So it's on the sterling silver chain is what I'm getting at in case you were curious. But that was just a little fun tidbit about me. I can't have like fake metal. So Claire's and me don't work unless it's sterling silver. And to go along with my necklace, my parents are, of course, you know, letting me 
have a car in May. And they also got me a ski trip with my dad because, okay, here's another fun story. Since it's Vlogmas, I'm gonna talk a lot. When my dad graduated high school, one of his friend's dads gave him the advice that if you don't think you're ready for college, don't waste the money on college. So he was like, oh, great. So he moved to Colorado with his friends and they worked at a ski place and that's all they did. They would just ski every single day. They would teach people. It was literally their life for a year. Yeah, that's what I got for my 16th birthday. I could not have enjoyed any more and literally the money was the best thing ever, I swear. So if you guys are wondering what to ask for for your birthday, I mean, money is great. The pajamas too and this little basket my sister put together, they all slayed. It was so great. So if any of my family or anyone who got me anything is watching this, I want to thank you so, so much because I literally appreciate everything I got. And I hope that you guys are having a wonderful day. Your word of advice is to smile today. Know that you're loved and I do this a lot. I'll get like really sad about something that I can't control. And I have to like, like it's hard for me and I have to pull myself back out of it because if I can't control it, then there's no need for me to be sad about it. So I love you guys. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you on Vlogmas Day 4 tomorrow. And I hope you're having a wonderful time. I know you guys have been mentioning you like the shorter videos, so I'll keep up with those.